Hey, hey. Thank you for watching my channel. I am the Divine Maverick, but you can call me Divine. Uh, thank you for your likes, your subscribes, your shares, your comments. I appreciate y'all so much. Y'all giving me life in those comments. And I want to say this while I'm thinking about it. Um, if you can, it would really behoove you to watch the video to until the end. Messages come out the entire time. Once you click on the video and I start talking, all of it's part of the message. Whether I'm singing a song, laughing, cracking jokes, reading from a Oracle book, it's all part of the message and it's important. And so um, it would just behoove you to listen. If you don't have time to, to sit you know, in one sitting, then, you know, do it when you have time so you can keep the energy flowing of it. If you have to split it up, that's fine. It's on you, but I'm just saying, try to be sure that you watch the whole video. And that's, that's with any reader that you, um, that you subscribe or ascribe to. That was just free. I, I really felt like I needed to say that, um, because, um, some instructions are being missed. Um, some guidance is being, uh, is being missed because it's not taken and because it's not heard. So, Try to watch the videos um, when you have time. Uh, time. All right. Time. That's a message for somebody. Um, you think you don't have enough time or you don't use your time wisely. Divine Feminine. Divine Feminine learns balance. That's what we do. <laughs> okay? So um, there's a message for you. It's about time. It's about time. For some of you, uh, the time is now. It's about time. Some of you have been asking um, a question and, and, and the, the Spirit is saying, it's about time. You asked me that. It's about time you felt like going this direction. It's about time you moved. It's about time you put in your resignation for that job. It's about time. It's about time that you got started, I'm hearing. It's about time that you started this project. It's about time that you launched this. It's about time that you finished this. Huh? It's about time that you finished this. Whatever that is, that addiction, that bad habit, that toxicity, that toxic relationship, that toxic friendship. The relationship doesn't necessarily have to be an intimate relationship. It can be, you know, somebody at work that you uh, gossip way too much with or something. Or they, being around them makes you want to gossip or talk about the problems and not the solutions. Anyway. Anyway. Okay, so um, if you watched the last video, and if you haven't, let me, uh, it's called, like, Use Your Power for Good. Um, I did it just before I did... Uh, I'm doing this one and there were some cards that came out and they actually go with the cards that are in here. Now I put the cards away now. I've put them back in the deck and shuffled, but it doesn't matter. I remember what they are, but, um, these I'm using my sacred, uh, geometry, you know, oracles. And I love these because, you know, if, if you have this deck or you buy this deck, the symbols in there, if you stare at them long enough, they begin to activate. These are activation cards. Okay. Um, so, um, lot, lots of good energy on this card. And I love that I can, I see the, I can see the signs, all 12 signs represented in the colors of this card, including the colors of the chakras in, in pr the prosperity card. But the 20, the card number 26 empowerment came out and card number 36 prosperity. So I'm going to say this, um, in the last reading, and again, if you didn't see it, just, you know, go look at it. But I said two words that I didn't know what they meant. And I said, y'all look it up. I just kind of said, y'all look it up. And spirit told me, make sure that I gave you guys the definitions. And in doing that, I, I have another message. I have more messages. So here we go. I said the word promulgate, P-R-O-M-U-L-G-A-T-E. And that is defined as, that means to promote or make widely known as an idea or a cause, you know what I mean? <laughs> Isn't that awesome? And so, um, along with your emergence, um, because of, there was a card that came out in the last reading about emerge, share your voice, come out of the cave. Some of you are coming out of the cave and you're beginning to talk, right? You're beginning to reach a lot of people because you're now uh, make, letting your voice be heard. You're letting yourself be seen, okay? And so, with that um, means that the message that you're carrying or what you are speaking is beginning to be made widely known and being promoted, meaning other people are saying something that you've said. You're teaching people and they are there, they're taking it and teaching others. You're promulgating an idea. You are promulgating a cause. You're starting something. You're spreading it, right? Okay, second definition in that is put into law or decree. Uh, you put into effect by proclamation. Okay, in other words, something... 
uh, happens in the earth because it was spoken, because it was a pro it was proclaimed. You know, they proclaimed that Jesus Christ was born. Therefore, they spoke it into the earth, and and it had to be. It let everything that vibrated know that the Savior, if you will, that's what you ascribe to, because because Jesus is my ascended Master. So, okay. But if that he's not yours, it's okay. I still love you. Listen, we ain't gonna we ain't gonna major on the minors. We're gonna get the messages out, okay? Anyway, um, so uh, what's what I saying? See, when I do that, okay, swing it back around for me one time. When and so Jesus, his name was proclaimed in the earth. So once something is spoken in the earth, let there be light, and there was light. Right? We're made in the image of the divine. So once once something is spoken in the earth, divine feminine, then it must be so. And what has been spoken in the earth that you need to know is your twin is your twin is your twin is your twin. It doesn't matter how many karmics. It doesn't matter how many babies out of wedlock or babies in wedlock. How many times they've been married to other people. It has been proclaimed in the earth, and therefore. For everything that vibrates, everything that has breath, everything that hears, praise the Lord, every, meaning the law, that everything that has breath, follow the law that you know. What is the law? The law is the truth, the way, and the life. What is the truth, the way, and the life? It's simply who we are, and it's love. If you don't remember anything else about this twin flame journey that is hard as yes, hell, if you don't remember anything else, remember that when it seems like everything is lost and everything is falling apart and nothing is true that you've ever heard, remember that only love is real. Only love. Only love is real. Welcome to the temple. Welcome to the temple. That's what we're going to start calling these readings. Welcome to the temple. And I'm your host, the Divine Maverick. Second definition. Uh, propagate. I said the next word, propagate, P-R-O-P-A-G-A-T-E, propagate, right? And it says, it, the first definition is it breeds specimens of a plant or animal by natural processes from the parent stock, okay? I'm going to get there, but let me touch something else first before I get there. It means spread and promote. Here we go again. Promulgate, propagate, spread and promote, an idea or a theory widely. Didn't we just say that propagate, let me go back to it, promulgate was promote or make widely known a cause or an idea. Propagate means to spread and promote an idea or a theory. You are the truth. You carry in the truth in your spirit, babies. What is the truth? What you're carrying. Because there is no variation of turning. Wisdom, there is no variation of turning. We serve the father of lights. We are connected to the light because we are light workers. And in the father of lights, cosmos, father, mother, earth, there is no variation of turning. It's only love and it's only light. And you get to carry both, star seed. You, are, you have to be illuminated in order for you to shine light on others around you. Did you hear that? Beautiful. You have to be illuminated in order for your light to begin to shine for others around you. You are lighting the way. And your path is being lit by what truth is and what love is. Because you can give up this journey. You can try to get away from this journey. But dear heart, you're going to walk this path. Because this must needs be. You are carrying seed in your body that must come to fruition and manifestation on the earth. For such a time as this, that's what you've been called to. That's why you don't go to the Walmart and fight karmics. That's why you don't stalk karmics or, or key up karmics cars. That's why you don't get mad at your masculine because he doesn't know any better or can't do any better. Eight of swords energy stuck, but doesn't know that he can walk around, walk right out. I, why did I just say Dutton? I've never said Dutton in my life. If that's some kind of dialect from city, let me know Dutton. Who says Dutton? I meant to say doesn't. I said that, that's how I speak, but I'm channeling, but it, neither, nonetheless, but he doesn't know how to get out, how to walk away from it. But that's why, you, because you have to be illuminated to shed light for others, that's why you're not low vibrational. That's why you don't waste time being jealous over a, a, a karmic lesson. You don't, you don't war with a karmic. You war over or you overcome the karmic or the karma. And you stay elevated, queen, queen of wands, right? Empress, you stay elevated. Queen of Cups, you say elevated Queen of Pentacles because you're too rich and fertile for that kind of foolishness, right? I love y'all. I love y'all. First definition, let's go back to this one, then we're going to talk and we're, and we're going to go. Breed specimens. The next definition for propagate 
means to breed specimens of a plant or animal by natural processes from the parent stock. Now, let me show you the picture that Spirit gave me. I saw what I do in the, in the natural, in real life. I love plants. I love house plants. I wish I had a greenhouse or three, right? And so what I like to do instead of purchasing plants, I would, my grandmama taught me, she calls it root. I root plants. I just, so I use the parent or the, the main plant. I cut a little piece off of it and then I put the plant in water, what I cut off and I let the root, it begin to take a root. And when it gets nice and strong, then I put it in the soil and I got a whole nother house plant by the next year, big and luscious and beautiful. That's what I do. I, I was taught it was called rooting a plant. This word propagate is that same thing. It's just a big $5 word, propagate. Okay, I don't root plants anymore. Now I propagate them. <laughs> you know what I mean? But check this out. That's what, you're, that's what you're doing, divine feminine. That's why you rate each one, teach one. You see, you're cut from the, the, the stock, right? Your baby comes from you. And then you make more and more. Everything you touch, you produce. Everything that touches you begins to, to grow. It produces because it comes from mama. All right, ma? Mommy? Remember that? Everything, listen. You are parent stock. Anything that comes off of you must grow just like you. I look just like my mama. I look, I favor my daddy. I'm made in the image of the divine. See that? We are made in the image of God. Therefore, we are in his image. It's not rocket science. Huh. Some of y'all might be rocket scientists watching this. Thank you for what you do. <laughs> Star seeds. You just want to go back home. That's why you became a rocket scientist. I got to get back. I got to get back out there, right? This earth is too, this earth binds me too much. I got to be free. I'm celestial. <laughs> I'm cosmological, right? Anyway, anyway, anyway. So I was, I had to read those, um, let me go back to YouTube. I had to read those uh, definitions to you, Empress, because let me get my, my music back on. I had to read those definitions to you because Spirit said it's important because it goes with the reading. It's like the next level the next place of the reading so now let's talk about these two cards and let me get the message out to you guys this word this card this word this card empowerment came out for you it's number 26 i gotta tell you that this card impact this number empowerment came right after the emergence card in here card number 25 in this deck is is called emerge which is simply come out of the cave which came out in our last reading on use your power for good again if you haven't seen that go see that video and that ties in with this video right so anyway um, this card says the frequency, because remember, everything is on a frequency. So we're, what we're activating now is the frequency of empowerment. That's what we're activating now. So I decree that over you now that you will now begin to move in the frequency of empowerment. And this is going to help you bring your union in with the divine masculine because there's work that has to be done. Is that song again? I, I got work to do. I got work, baby. <laughs> I got a job, baby. Whoa. Anyway, uh, empowerment, right? So you're bringing this in, right? The frequency of empowerment supports our ability to show up fully and completely, uniting us with others in the deep trust that we are all connected through the same source. In other words, this is like almost fine. When you find your soul tribe, because that also came out in the other reading. Your soul tribe is being assembled right now. If you don't recognize them right now, don't worry. They recognize you. They've heard the clarion call and they're now coming for you. I didn't say looking for you. I said they're coming for you. And your soul tribe is going to help you, like I said, with this twin flame journey. Because it is hard and you cannot, nor were you called to do it alone. Man shall not live by bread alone, nor is it good for man to be alone. And when uh, the scripture says man shall not live by bread alone, that simply means you can't Think your own thoughts and think you're going to be able to uh, overcome this thing called life. You have to hear and be connected to spirit. You have to hear from spirit. Therefore, you have to be surrounded by spiritual people. You have to be surrounded by people like you. You are now being empowered, divine feminine, right? In order to do what you need to do. You're now being empowered to be fully and completely united with those other souls that are like you so that you can move in power too, right? But like I said, this card came right after the 25 is emergence, 26 is empowerment. So you have come out, right? Some of you, again, you have, you have, um, you have your own businesses. You just, just, you just leveled up. You moving in things. Some of you, I see a PTO president, parent teacher organization president. And you know what I mean? You like, you just, you hustle at them fundraisers. They like, they think you're some kind of phenom. Like, listen, leave it to her. She'll get us, she'll get us that $8,000. Leave it to her. That playground equipment is a piece of cake. She's good. 
You know, some of you are real estate agents and you're working your tail off, honey. I see you. And I love the new sign. I, listen, that's the best picture you've taken so far. You know why? Because you emerged and now you're empowered. You know who you are. Now you know how to pose. At first, you used to be scared to take pictures. You were very self-conscious. You're like, I hate makeup. I don't like to dress it like this. I'm so self-conscious. Now you're like, cheese. You know what I mean? I see it. I see it. You go, Fina, right? You're beautiful. Look at that. This card, the empowerment card didn't want to stay up there. Even the empowerment card was like, don't put me on that easel like a like I'm some kind of doll baby. Let me get down and move. Y'all didn't see that card fall off that easel? Did y'all see that? That card fell right off. Some of y'all just said, look, take me off the shelf. Take me off. Some of y'all are coming from behind your mother's shadow or your parent's shadow. Some of you are coming from behind your big sister's shadow. Some of you are come, just coming out. I'm coming out. I want the world to know I got to let it show And that doesn't mean we coming out And I got to live And I want to give I'm completely positive <laughs> I love it. Anyway, this empowerment card, you are empowered. So you're jumping down. You're like, don't put me on a shelf. Don't put me in the corner. Don't put me. Listen, I don't want the corner office. I just heard that. Some people want the corner office. Divine Feminist, some, one, some of y'all said, I don't want the corner office. Put me in the front. Put me where the reception is so they can see me. The receptionist says, so they can see me as soon as they come in. Some of y'all are the first thing that people see when they walk through the door. Some of y'all are having decisions being made about whether partnerships are going to be formed because the first thing that in, the client sees is you sitting there and you go hi and they're like yes this company right here it's your aura boo ma it's your aura you're gorgeous and i'm not just blowing smoke but guess what if i wanted to i could i mean i could literally blow smoke if i wanted to because i command the elements huh what that's why i said and i'm an air sign what you don't think i can blow smoke and <laughs> listen I ain't talking about the kind of smoke you're talking about. Get your mind right. Get your perception right, which we'll get to in a minute. But get, yeah, perceive things the right way. I'm not blowing smoke, meaning she's lying. No, I'm talking about if I wanted to blow smoke right now, just because I wanted to blow smoke, I can because I'm an air sign and I command the elements. That's what I said. Okay. Card number 36 is prosperity. <laughs> and this is about more than money. I'm going to tell you that right now. Here's spirit say. This is about more than money. This is about more than money. This is about more than money. There's a scripture that says, beloved, above all things, I wish that your soul prosper or your health prosper, even as your soul prospers, right? I, I want you to feel good even as your soul prospers. In other words, when your uh, health gets, your health will get better when your soul gets better. And this is all about that soul work. Some of you have been soul searching, right? Some of you are done with a soul mate because you met your twin and had, you have been soul searching. And you're like wondering, what is this? What is this? I need some answers. Here's your answer. You were divinely led to this video to tell you that, yes, you are on the twin flame journey. Welcome. Have a seat. <laughs> Welcome. Have a seat. Someone will be with you shortly. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Welcome. Yeah, come on. Have a seat. Someone will be with you shortly. And that someone will be the, your, your good girlfriend, another feminine that's going to say, girl, and then she's going to take your, she's going to triage you. We're going to triage you in this soul tribe. And we're going to say, let's see where she is. And we'll know where you are as soon as you open your mouth. And because we don't, some of us don't talk in person, we'll know where you are as soon as you get that keyboard and start telling your business, telling your situation. I'm tired of this. I'm leaving him. I'm over this. I'm done. Bump him. He can have her. He can keep them. I don't care. Okay, we triaging. We know where she is. The other feminists that have ears to hear, eyes to see, they go, mm-hmm. Some of them are saying, I just saw my masculine. It made me feel so good. Then I felt so bad. You know, we know how to triage you, okay? That's part of the soul tribe and the prosperity that you're now coming into. Let me decree that over you right now, too. Look at that. Look at that symbol. Look at that sacred geometric shape. Prosperity is upon you now. The frequency of prosperity, it, it supports our feeling of well-being by allowing the inclusion of everything that makes our body, mind, heart, soul, and spirit sing. Remember the card from the last reading that said beauty? You're creating beauty. Everywhere you go, you're supposed to create beauty around you and devotion. Everything, the rose, you know, you're, you're beautiful. Everything about you is beautiful. You know, and when you, when you, it's touched by you, the moment you enter the place, it has your scent, it has your look, it has your mark on it. That's what this card is about, prosperity. It says everything, your, your mind, your body, your heart, your soul, and your spirit, it makes it sing. You are part of that. That is part of you now. 
right now as we're speaking. You're activated in it now. And it says prosperity invites us to express ourselves in joy and celebrations of the abundance and riches that the universe provides because God will provide. He owns the cattle on a thousand hills is what the scripture says, right? One of the scriptures, one of the holy texts say that, right? The holy Bible that I read. It says, so everything that belongs to him belongs to me. That makes me prosperous. But again, it's more than about earthly things. This is about spiritual things. I'm rich in the spirit too. I'm spiritually rich. And what makes me spiritually rich? Because I know that my, I'm full of his spirit. I'm full of light and love. I'm full of everything that ever was and ever is and ever will be. Hmm. I'm full of it. Or, or simply put, I am. You fill in the blank. That's what true prosperity is. True prosperity is not what you have in the bank what kind of car you pushing, what kind of house you live in. That's good, but that's not divine. Divine says prosperity is I am, meaning anything I say that I have can do and be is mine. That's what makes me prosperous. As long as I know who I am, I'll never be broke. Did you hear that, divine family? As long as I know who I am, I will never be broke a day in my life because I can always speak and create something that I need. That's true prosperity. See, you can get some money and then spend the money and money may run out or money may get low. But when you are <laughs> the money, show me the money. When you are the money, Jerry Maguire, you had me at hello. Spirit said, I had you at hello. As soon as I said, as soon as I introduced myself to you, Spirit said, as soon as I came knocking at your door saying, wake up, daughter, Talitha Kumi, daughter arise, Isha, daughter arise, Talitha Kumi, daughter arise. As soon as I said, daughter arise, hello, hello, is it me you're looking for? As soon as I said, hello, I had you, Jerry Maguire, show me the money. I am. You don't need money when you are money. You're everything that ever was, that ever is, and ever will be. That's what you're made of. That's the stuff that you're made of. Oh, that's good to me. Whew. All right, feminists, let's get one angel oracle card for you. And let me get y'all up out of here. Thank you so much for watching. If you um, want a private reading with me, everything you need to know about me can be found in the description box below. Um... Thank you. For, did I already thank you for the likes and everything? I told y'all that, right? If I didn't, forgive me. Thank you for everything. I love y'all. I'm just trying to get these messages out. And did I encourage you to watch the video to the very end? I did. If I didn't, make sure you... <laughs> I love this. <laughs> Courage! Hmm. I love this. By the way, card number 37 in this deck, after prosperity is fertility. As after prosperity is fertility. For some of you, the message is you're going to secure the bag. And what I mean by that is your money, your, the level of your money is going to come way, way up. And then you're going to have the baby because, you know, the baby needs a, um, the baby, a baby need a new pair of shoes. The baby has needs, right? So um, if that was your question, like, God, when, God, when? Some of you had a question about whether you're going to get pregnant before or after you get married because some of you guys are saying, married to your twin, I mean, because some of you guys are saying, I don't want to wait. You know, I don't want to, you know, I don't need a piece of paper. My heart, I, I got all that. That's good, too. But then there's others of you that want to have a, a, the wedding, the white wedding. It's a good day for white wedding. <laughs> white wedding. Billy Idol. That's back in the day. I don't know why I said white wedding, but some of you want to have a white wedding, right? Um. I almost said some of you just want um, all white people at your wedding, but, but you might have a wedding where it's only white people there and that's okay. That's okay. Cause the blood is red. It's okay. We have different hues, but the blood is red, honey. If you don't believe me, cut. No, I was gonna say cut somebody. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. I reverse that now. Reverse, reverse, reverse. All right. Listen, but <laughs> card number 37 is the fertility card. So after the bag, after the prosperity comes, meaning you're rich in soul and materially, rich in soul and materially, rich in soul and materially, then you're going to have the baby. The baby's going to come. But in between time and, and in the meantime, the empowerment is going to come because you are courageous. Archangel Ariel says, be courageous and stand up for your beliefs. Propagate your beliefs. Promulgate your beliefs. Let them be spread widely. Let them be made widely known. Tell the people that you know who is who is king and lord, right? Say, say it. 
Show them, manifest, manifest in the power that you know that you've been endowed with. Man, be all that you can be. Be divine. You are created in the image of God. So show them what a goddess looks like. Show them what a God looks like. Divine masculine, divine feminine, twin flame journey. Show them what heaven looks like. The twin flame union. That's heaven on earth. The kingdom is at hand. The kingdom is, is, is at hand. When you show up in your union, heaven is on earth because your love is going to make people fall in love. Your power is going to make others feel powerful and be powerful. Your belief is going to cause people to believe. That's who you are. It's who you are. It's who you are. It's who you are. And I am loved by you. That's who I am. That's who I am. Huh. That's who I, I am. See, I am. I am. I am courage. I love you guys. I love you guys. I And there's nothing you can do. Oh, wait. I just got to show you this. Oh, Jesus. Look at the card. Y'all see that lion's eye? Look at that eye. That, listen, he ain't. And that's even her spirit animal. Some of you, some of you have a, a, a lion as your spirit animal. You are fierce. Come on, Judah. What did they send before the battle? What did they do? They, say, they sang. Didn't they say be joyful, spread beauty? B music is beautiful. The sound of worship and praise is beautiful. And they always sent Judah first. Send praise. That's the Hebrew word for praise. Judah. They sent Judah first. Some of y'all need to get happy first. Listen, some of y'all need to get happy. Believe it first about your union coming. Believe it first that that's your masculine. Go ahead and praise uh, the, the creator for who he is before Raman before you see him, before you see it. Listen, I hear the spirit say, if you praise me, if you thank me, if you show an attitude of gratitude, if you are grateful for all things, grateful for creation, grateful for life, breath, the simple things. If you begin to thank me that I gave you this person, your person, your divine masculine, begin to thank me for, be, feel it, feel your husband, feel your, your person, feel them with you. No matter where they are in the world, feel them with you. When you do that, before you even see it, he said, watch me do it. Watch me bring it together. I'll do it. Be courageous and know. Praise him in advance. Be happy now. Feel the union now so that you can vibrate correctly, so you can get on the frequency. If you still feel separate, you will be separate. As a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. So if you're feeling the separation, huh? if you're feeling the separation, divine feminine, that's because you're vibrating there. That's the frequency you're on. Change the station and feel him with you. Feel her with, feel them together. Ibashu. Feel them with you. Know it. Know it is so. And don't doubt. Know it is so. You can't look with your eyes. You must hear with your heart. Your heart has ears. Your heart has ears. Your heart can hear. Your heart can hear the whispers of the divine saying, be strong. And I'm not going to not look at the two. It's two lions back there. And if you look at that card good, that looks like a, fe a female and it looks like a male because you can see his mane. You can see his mane. And I'm getting the whole, and that looks like the woman, the, the female, the excuse me, the lioness, but look what's between them. That woman, that's Archangel Ariel. This twin flame journey is going to need courage to come through, come through. It's going to need, it's going to take courage, but know that, look, the angel is in front of you. You are being guided. You are being led. There's more for you than there are against you. Some of you are worrying about social people, society. What are they going to think when we get together? Are they going to like the karmic more than me? What are they going to think? What is, what? Oh, I can't believe it. You need courage for this journey, baby. But you have an angel right ahead of you. And you guys are together. Look. You're together here. You're already together. 
And look how close they are. You're not as separate as you think you are. That's somebody's message. You're not as separate as you think you are. You're not as separated as you think you are. Look, they are one thought away. Your masculine is one thought away from being right there. Right there. One thought away. All right. This is good. Like, subscribe, share, comment. Help us grow the channel. Help us with our... The, the more you share, the more you like, the more we subscribe, we grow this soul tribe and we can level up. We can gather our tribes and, and do this thing. We are part of the, the answer to what is ailing Mother Earth. We are the part of the answer. We are the answer. All right. Till we meet again, take care of yourselves. I love y'all. Take care of yourselves and each other. Bye.